Inversions can form on calm, clear winter nights. Once the sun goes down, the ground loses heat very quickly. This cools the air close to the ground, but the air just above remains warm. Calm winds prevent the warmer air from mixing down to the ground. Clear skies and long nights increase the amount of cooling, and mountains can actually enhance the formation of inversions, especially in valleys. On a regular day, an inversion would weaken or disappear. However, with high pressure in the region, inversions can last for several days. Air quality suffers as a result. The warm air on top acts like a lid, trapping the cooler air down at the surface. As pollutants from vehicles, fireplaces, and industry enter the air, they also become trapped by the warmer air above. The biggest culprit is actually residential wood burning. Wood smoke contains much higher amounts of pollution than smoke from oil or gas-fired fireplaces. And we do have that inversion in the atmosphere. It's in the Northwest, and we have high pressure in place. So with the inversions, we are looking at poor air quality for the next couple days. Washington, that lasts until Monday. Down into Oregon, this will be through Tuesday as that air just isn't going to mix after those cold overnights.